morning everyone happy tuesday it is a little bit spooky out today it's like crazy foggy i think you might be able to kind of see out my window like the car is not fogged up at all that's just how foggy it is you can't really see like even a block up when you're driving um it's really weird the camera doesn't even show like how foggy it is but it was so like dreary when I got up that I was like okay I'm gonna treat myself to my favorite little coffee shop this morning so we got him now it's time to head home and get this day started so yeah now I am going to kind of continue on with my little morning routine I've been working on and then cook myself some breakfast I don't know what I want to eat today I think I only have one of my yummy um turkey sausages left but I think I'll have eggs and that and yeah reheated my coffee just to let it sit and get back to being like lukewarm again because this is so silly but I was <laughs> trying to pick out my outfit for the day and basically since we're working out tonight I just like to put on what I'm gonna wear to the gym and I couldn't decide what I wanted to wear because like half of my active wear actually probably like 90% of my active wear is dirty so yeah, I was wandering around trying to pick an outfit out that I don't need for the next <sighs> however many hours. Anyway, we're going to do a little morning skincare routine today. Um, I'm going to do a little bit of a different routine. and I'm going to kind of show you guys that. But I want to do a little bit of either jade, uh, not jade, rolling, but rose quartz rolling or rose quartz gua sha honestly my arm is so much darker than my face <laughs> because i put on tanner yesterday but i don't want to tan my face until tomorrow because if i put it on now then i'm just going to get sweaty and gross in like a, a few hours and i i'd rather just wait tomorrow is a rest day um i might still do something but it's probably going to be a rest day so Starting with the Tula Brightening Vitamin C Drops. I put out a guide on Instagram. I don't know if any of you guys have seen those before. I think it's a new feature, but they're super, super cool. And so I put out a guide on the three Tula serums and I kind of explain how I use them every day, why I like them, what I use them for. So if you want to learn more, um, you can go to my Instagram in the guide section and I kind of break down what i like about them and you can actually shop right from the guide which is pretty cool so what you're going to need is like your favorite face oil this is mine this is from wild carrot apothecary um and it's their red raspberry seed oil i don't know something about this my skin just loves so i'm actually just going to take probably like Two pumps. I don't know why my pump's really not wanting to come out. Warm that up in my hands. And then just sort of pat it onto the face. Then I'm going to take my little heart gua sha tool, which I keep in the fridge. And I'm just going to massage my face a little bit. This helps with any puffiness and it helps drain out your lymphatic system. I'm going to make sure you put on like a really... Um, liquidy serum or a face oil before you do this so that the tool can just glide across your skin and it's not going to be dragging your skin because if your skin's too dry doesn't have enough slip to it it'll just be pulling your skin and that's not what you want but basically you want to be pulling the skin kind of up and away towards your ear and then once you work everything to your ear you'll bring it down through your neck I'm just gonna also do a little bit of jade rolling because I just love how this feels under my eyes. Take the smaller side and just get right under there. Oh, if you need to wake up ever and you're just feeling like so out of it, pick up one of these rollers. You can get them anywhere now. Um, great stocking stuffers, both of these. 
All right, last thing for skincare this morning. Well, almost last thing. I'm gonna put on a little bit of eye cream. Um, I don't normally put the oil like directly under my eyes. So this will just add a little bit of moisture out here. And then of course I will apply a lip balm or lip mask. I kind of can't go without those in the winter. And regardless of if I'm doing more of a lip balm or a lip mask, it's almost always Laneige. So these are my two favorite lip products. Like if I couldn't have anything ever again, I would just use these. Honestly, if I could only have one thing, I would just have this. You guys, the sun is out. I thought it was going to be foggy and gross literally all day, but it's so bright and happy out now. This is awesome. I'm cooking lunch. I'm making... um some shrimp to go in fried rice so I'm just cooking them up in a little bit of butter and garlic salt and pepper and then Charles actually made us fried rice um, two days ago I think he made it a couple days ago and I'm gonna let these cook a little bit and then I'm just gonna throw however much rice I want in here and kind of heat everything up together so it all mesh nicely but this was our first time making fried rice in a while and he did such a good job. It's so yummy. So, very excited for that. Um, and I'm just so happy the sun's out. this is the finished product this looks so stinking yummy I'm probably gonna eat this in about two seconds because I am so hungry okay that lunch was delicious but I'm still hungry I'm probably going to make myself a banana and peanut butter before I get back to work I was trying to distract myself from the hunger and see if it was just like like I just needed to let it settle so I started laundry I started the dishwasher I like did a bunch of cleaning and I'm like nope still hungry so post lunch post lunch snack um basically immediately after is definitely happening I was gonna wait to have a banana and peanut butter like a little bit before the gym but I'll just have it now okay it is that time of the day I've tried a new flavor I started this yesterday it's strawberry glow and this is really yummy this reminds me of like a, a strawberry kiwi capri sun I'm a fan all right it is the time of the day where I go pick up Charles. We're gonna come back right after that, have a quick snack and bump to the gym. The gym's literally, you can walk there in like a minute from our house. So it's not out of the way to like come back here, which is nice. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna go get him, probably eat the rest of my banana and then we'll head to the gym. It has seriously cleared up to be such a nice day. This morning we had to scrape ice off the car. I was in my parka and now it's sunny, it's beautiful. I'm literally just in like basically a t-shirt. Like it's December, I don't, I'm not complaining about this weather because it's so nice, but I'm a little <laughs> All right, we are officially back from the gym. Um, I think we got exactly like one clip of working out footage it was a it was a little more busy tonight but it was still it was okay um but yeah i couldn't even talk after the workout i pretty much immediately had to shower i'm in my pjs now <laughs> and i'm gonna cook us some spaghetti for dinner so very exciting
All right, you guys, we just finished up dinner. Spaghetti was the perfect meal after that leg workout. Now, I think we're just gonna watch some Brooklyn Nine-Nine and I'm gonna edit this vlog and then that'll be it for the night. So, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. If you have anything you wanna see during Vlogmas, leave it down in the comments below and that's it. I will see you guys again very, very soon.